my name is Caitlin Verbal and today I'm going, my speech is about why you shouldn't text and drive. I know this is a big thing in the world right now considering everything is like technology and everybody, all everyone cares about social media and all that kind of stuff. So I thought this would be something I would like to talk about and basically tell people why you shouldn't do it. You know, there's 2.6 million or plus car wrecks a year and half of that is caused by cell phone use when you're driving and people don't realize this I know they made a law that states if you're texting or driving you can get in trouble for that but I drive down the road and I still see people using their phones while driving and you know people say you know I'm a good driver I, I can text and drive without swerving all over the road but it takes three seconds of looking down at your phone for an accident to occur you know within those three seconds Anything can go in front of your car, and if you look up at last second, or if you're not looking up at all, you obviously don't have time to swerve away and avoid it, and people don't realize that when you text and drive or just be distracted by your phone while driving, you can not only ruin your life, but someone else's if you cause a car accident. Um, like a long time ago when I was like 10 years old my neighbor was speeding down our neighborhood and she hit my dog and killed my dog right in front of me because she was too worried about what she was talking about on the phone and that was years ago and people to this day still do that and it's crazy to me you know texting and driving causes six times more car accidents than drunk driving does and neither of those things are okay and people still do it. I think it's because people say, oh, well, it hasn't happened to me. It won't happen to me. That can't happen to me. Well, you don't know that, you know? You could be looking down at your phone and then someone pull out in front of you or someone's driving out on the wrong side of the road and they crash into you. You know, at that point, it's both of your faults because you weren't paying attention, so you couldn't swear out of the way. They weren't paying attention because who knows what they weren't paying attention for, you know? everyone's always like you know I'm a good driver and all this stuff but I, that doesn't matter you know ruining someone's life ruining your life is not worth a text message or a Facebook post or a snapchat picture none of it is worth it and I really want people to understand that because obviously nobody does I mean I'm sure there's some people like me and a lot of other people do but there's still so many people that really just could care less because they think since it happened to them it won't happen to them but that's not true Thank you.